And hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Crusader Kings 2. Last time we had uh, gotten to a war with England. It is actually... France is at war with England, and we joined France because we married our bastard child off to France, so now they're our ally. Which is actually very useful. We do need to make England weaker, so eventually we can destroy them. So now I guess we're just going to try and... We don't want to really raise troops to attack England too much. Let's see, my co-conspirator hired someone to saw through the support rails, the railing beneath the Mayor Magnus. Oh yeah, that's right, we, uh, we're planning to kill this mayor who hates us. We have a pretty good chance, 162%. But uh, in the meantime, we're to come over and uh, do some stuff to England. My liege, it's almost unfortunate you happen to hold title that I, uh, my brother wants my land. Let's see. County of Gwent. My brother, he's already a duke. No, F you. All right. Mayor, he discovered the sabotage. But the plot is revealed. That sucks. The carburetor we used to saw it um, was captured. So plot's revealed to murder that mayor. That's fine. We're still going to kill him. We have enough plot power. We can't actually siege anything. I do just want to kind of... Oh, that, do I want to... Wait, wait, wait. Okay, well, I just killed that army. Oh, I do want to kill them. I thought they weren't England, but they are England. Alright, so now we're going to poison him. That's fine. Let's just start killing some English troops. They had an advantage. Not a good enough advantage, though. Uh, we could try and just besiege the Isle of Man if we wanted to. Uh, we suc successfully killed that mayor, which is good. Uh, he died not knowing the name of his killer. That's very nice. What I should do is start murdering people who actually are trying to take my power, but at the same time, eh. Eh. So we're gonna... Ooh. Construction increased in Ormond. Let's just kind of move around and try and take out some troops that are just like roaming around. We're not really trying to capture anything at the moment. Oh, here's some people. The Lancastrian army. We'll take them. To war! Fantastic. This will at least get our prestige up and maybe people like us a little bit more. Every little bit helps. And we're also killing time until our uh, Chancellor actually can fabricate a claim. My steward died. That is unfortunate. Um, you can be my steward. You're actually pretty good. How about you, uh, research economy technology? What does our technology look like right now? We can't upgrade anything. Well, we can upgrade trade, but we don't have any trading posts, so it doesn't really matter. Let's just keep going. Um, we want to move. Uh, let's see here. Let's move down here. Let's join up. Let's just attach to these French forces. It seems like an okay idea. I mean, if our men die, the people who hate us are going to try and take that opportunity to overthrow us, but we have a lot more men. Uh, can we just attach? Yeah, let's just attach. Okay. Well, that's taken care of. They'll go around and start killing people, which is nice. Uh, in the meantime, you still have not fabricated a claim. It is amazing how ineffective you are. I guess we're just going to go for here? We'll just we'll just keep moving them around, and eventually we'll be able to make something happen. Oh, we actually kind of turned the tides with that battle. Yeah, we're helping out a lot. We're getting uh, a little prestigious here. A little bit of prestigious. Come on, murder them. The war is being lost. Substantially. That's okay. We don't have we don't have to win the war. We're not fighting for anything. We're just fighting for prestige. Got a little more prestige there, speaking of which. Uh, a lot of people want other people to be in charge. What exactly is going on here? So, 
my niece is the favorite heir right now. Wow. That's interesting. Uh, and then... King... Oh, the Earl of blah blah blah. And uh, my cousin. Okay. I'm not really threatened by them. I kind of want my child to be the uh, Preferatus, but that's okay. Uh, what can I do to make that happen? At, at least... My son. He's actually really bad at everything. Like, really bad. Hmm. I could just start giving him more land and make him more powerful, but I also don't want to do that. <laughs> uh, whenever I take any more land, I'll just give it to him. That's probably going to help. Uh, did I detach? I think I detached. Oh no, I'm... I'm still attached. Otherwise, we wouldn't be able to siege this. Interesting game. Very interesting. Okay. So anyway, what else do we need to do here? We need to get into our intrigue thingy. Where are you? Man, everybody hates us. This is real bad. So we have threats going on. We have some prisoners, including Kazvan from Kildar. Just want to... No. Um, I can't actually revoke his title. Unfortunately. I kind of want to nip that whole thing in the bud and just get rid of freaking everybody. Just murder everything. Who's in charge of this place? You are... You like me, so you're fine. Who's in charge of the city? Come on, show me. Uh, the mayor of Kildar, he, uh... He doesn't care? <laughs> I don't know. Man, nobody has kids. It's very strange. It was the Men Mercer, legendary underscore to plot where Prince Eugen of Ireland seeks to fabricate a claim on the county of Gwent. Prince Eugen of Ireland, the Duke of du Duhubioth. Yeah, I know I'm probably not saying that correctly, so I can imprison him. And I will. See my brother? Yeah, he's my brother. On a courtesy visit to the abbot of a local monastery, you observe a group of monks translating beautifully illustrated books into your language. I can gain prestige, but lose gold. And I may get learning. I will do that. That seems like a smart thing to do. So I can execute him or I can release him. Uh, my vassals will like me more if I release him, so I'm going to release him. Can I do that with anybody else? Any other prisoners that people give a crap about? No. That'll cost me piety. That'll give me gold, but he won't take her. I'm just going to keep her. Yeah, we are losing this war pretty heavily. Which is strange. Oh, that's because most of the war is happening down here in the mainland. <laughs> that's bad. Can we declare war? Okay, let's let this hash out. But I want to declare war for the Isle of Man while this is all happening. I wonder if that's possible. We have gained a lot of prestige from this war, by the way. We gained like 100. 10% more. Might as well just let it ride, I think. That's probably better, just to let it keep going. Yeah. I wonder if I could, though. I doubt I can. Because I'm already at war. Yeah, I can't. Oh, well. That's fine. Oh, now my nephew is... He's preferred... How about... I don't even want you to be in jail. I just want you, kind of just want him dead, but whatever. Yeah, we're losing this war horribly, but I'm not losing men, which is good. Uh, we were successful in Rome. That is very nice. A little more uh, favor with the Pope. A message about arranged marriage with France. Who wants my daughter. 
Uh, if the prince marries the princess, I'll accept that. We're gonna try and forge a pretty strong alliance with France here. And hopefully they'll help us kill England. That's really what I want from them. Because Scotland, I can't fabricate a claim on Scotland right now, but if I could, I could probably take them out, honestly. Because I have a big enough war chest. That's why I'm saving my money, mostly. Is I want to save up money. Oh man, we lost our chaplain. I'm going to save up money and uh, buy a bunch of mercs and just kind of stomp Scotland into the dirt. But right now, we got to wait for everything. Everything to kind of has to settle down just a little bit. That's okay. We're uh, sieging up here. Should be able to take it. We can't keep it, unfortunately. Got a bunch more men rising up. Um, I can take on a lover. Yeah, why not? That's fine. Uh, we're going to... Oh, she... She told me no. Come on, you're just my cousin. Uh, we can't do anything. What else is here? We can plot to kill my granddaughter for some reason. Uh, our war is ended. So now I gotta bring my men back. That's okay. So England has a lot of men right now. They have like 12,000 men. We have nowhere near that. Uh, my liege, the most unfortunate you happen to hold the title. A spy master wants the Duchy of Gwynedd. He wants to be a duke. But you own Poes. The Duchy of Gwynedd. What is that? Can I just see my personal holdings? I forgot how to do that. Oh, here we go. Duchy of Gwynedd. Uh, I guess I'll make him a duke. I'd rather be in my family. Every time I make someone a duke who's not in my family, it goes wrong. You're just greedy. I am going to give that away. I'm going to give that away to my son. If I can. Duchy of Gwynedd. Send. So now he's a duke. My spy master left because my spy master didn't get the duchy that I, <laughs> that I just gave away. Oh well. Oh well. Sucks to be him, man. Those guys are suffering attrition, which is why they have a little skull. You gotta get your butt back. It's monthly, though, so they should regenerate pretty quickly once they return. Now, you seriously need to get a claim. I have nobody better than this idiot. Nobody? Oh, I do. Duke of Gwynedd. Meh. Go fabricate a claim. I just made you a duke. It's actually my son. <laughs> and my heir. <laughs> but that's okay. Go over there. Get me some more land. Because nothing's happened in a while. And it's starting to lose interest. This is why I'm kind of excited to actually get better at this game. Because then I can, like I said before. I want to be a Norse country and start raiding everybody. Where there's constant war. Right now, not a lot of war. Uh, we can actually... We should have a claim. Or you... You're not... What? I don't have a Cassus Belly on you anymore? Rise of the Hansa. We don't care. I no longer have a claim on the Isle of Man. That's annoying. Now nah, I'm just mad. <laughs> I don't know how that happened. How did I lose that claim? Did I lose that claim when my ruler changed? Because I had it. Before that war with England, I had that claim. Weird. Freaking weird. This game's getting weird. Like, for some reason, people aren't having families. Well, he actually has parents. But there have been a couple, like, courtiers I've gotten that don't have freaking families. So something's weird. <laughs> Uh, might as well get some more court members. This guy loves me and he's in jail. 
Why do you love me when you're in jail? Earl of Ostery? I'll let him go. Well, I'll, I'll ransom him to himself. Weird. Alright, well, he gave me money to get free. That's fine. Um, I've discovered a plot where Earl of Gwynedd wants to fabricate a claim. Oh, he's the guy who wanted a claim. He wanted me to just give him the duchy. And then I gave the duchy to my son. And now he's trying to fabricate a claim. So you're going to prison. And I can't... Can I revoke your titles? But the Earl of Gwynedd. I'll be merciful. Hopefully my vassals don't all hate me. Look, they're actually like... They're positive. Not very positive. But they're positive. So that's fine. We're doing better. Most people earn the green on me right now. Which is not... That's good. That's an accomplishment. I still can't freaking go to war at all. Which is probably my main goal of the game. Is to uh, take over countries. But, you know... It's the small victories. Even some of my prisoners like me for some reason, which is very strange. In prison for 14 years. Still likes me. Who are you? You were... You're from here. Weird. Are you ambitious? No. Should I le Should I let this guy go? How about, uh... Oh, I can ransom him for 10. I'll let him go. I'll be nice to some of my prisoners. What else can I do with my prisoners? Kill Dar guy, you're not going anywhere. You're gonna rot to death. Uh, Kazvan, you're going... Well, you're not... Freaking nephews. It's the family, man. Okay, if I release you... Are you ambitious? Yes. Okay, you're staying in jail, then. <laughs> um, how about we actually... Don't want to execute you. You're just going to stay in jail. Let time tick by while we're doing this. Uh, you've been in jail for 13 years! You are from the same place. Over there. From Wales. You hate me. Why do you hate me? Because you're imprisoned. <laughs> she actually likes me if she wasn't in jail. That's funny. Should I release you? Can I ransom you? Will anyone take you? No. I'll, I'll just release her. She's done her time. Look, I'm being a very nice king right now. Everyone should love me. Actually, I don't get a bonus to opinion unless it says explicitly per person if I get a bonus or not. But still, I mean, come on. It's the thought that counts. Let's uh, hold a summer fair. And how many years has it been? Marshal Dunleg caught the peddler sto selling stolen goods red-handed. I can either become cruel by killing him publicly... Or I can lock him up and take his money. I'm gonna execute him. Am I cruel? I'm zealous. I'm not cruel. That's good. Still waiting on a claim. Uh, this is suspicious. Oh, yeah. This is the one where the archer is way too good. I either become paranoid or just pay him. Or, uh, arrest him. I'm just gonna pay him because he won. Like, why wouldn't you win... Why wouldn't you pay the winner? Don't be crazy. Arrange marriage from... Oh. Local nobles of Thormund complain about too many peasants entering the city during the summer fair. Tell them to accept the peasants. Uh, to the glorious king, live in harmony. We propose that King Donald III of Scotland and Princess Maud of Ireland marry. King of Scotland and my daughter. Does that give... 
Because she has a claim on the Kingdom of Ireland, so they could press her claim and make her queen. But it will, her marrying the king won't give her a claim on Scotland. But it'll strengthen her alliance. But I don't want an alliance. <laughs> I kind of want to kill them, so I'm going to decline. Uh, fabricate a freaking claim, buddy. Do I have any? I have no claims on Scotland otherwise, do I? Here, where's the liege? Where's the liege? Liege. King of Scotland. Huh. They all died in battle. I can't declare war. I need to cost his belly. Uh, mercy. I could try and assassinate him. Very low percent chance to actually do it. And it won't actually give me anything besides I'll spend a lot of money, kill their king, and uh, accomplish basically nothing. We can actually send our chancellor to sow dissent, but that's actually worthless because you can't, like, nothing will happen. They might have a rebellion, but it doesn't give you a cost of spell to actually attack the country, so why would you even waste your time doing that? Um, so we're still just waiting for this guy to, like, fabricate a claim. Um, so thanks a lot for watching. I'm sorry nothing actually happened this episode. <laughs> oh. Uh, the summer fair is over. Arranged marriage from the King of Scotland. My cousin. You want to marry my cousin? Why? Duchess of the Hospitalier. Siblings, my cousins. I mean, I think that's okay, but I still don't want an alliance with Scotland. But anyway, yeah, thanks a lot for watching. Sorry nothing happened. I'll see you next time, and I'll try to make something happen. We're just really waiting on this guy to do something. Um, we did get some prestige from England. We got a lot of prestige, almost 200, which is nice. We actually successfully got our uh, dukes and duchesses to actually kind of like us. Not very much. But besides that, nothing really happened, and I'm, I'm actually getting a little bored, and I want to... I want to fight some people, so hopefully that'll happen next episode. Thanks a lot for watching, and I'll see you next time.